I don't think anyone's done it before, so it's original. Um, if you do want to copy it or something like that, please put credit if that's okay. Uh, let's get started then. First, choose whatever skin colour and gender you would like. So let's start up on the eyes. If you're doing a girl character, either do eyes 68 or 70. I choose 68. We're going to take a break from the eyes right now and start on the hair. So this bit is for girl's hair, I will do boy's hair after. If your favourite colour is green, add one ponytail. If your favourite colour is purple, add two ponytails. If your favourite colour is blue, add two buns. And if your favourite colour is pink, add one bun. And if your favourite colour is anything else, um, just do whatever. For the boys' hair now, if your favourite colour is orange, do like really scruffy hair. And if your favourite colour is purple, do like longish hair. Not that long, but still. Um, and if your favourite colour is anything else, um, do like sensible hair, like a kind of a nerdy kind of look. Going back to the eyes now, um, add whatever pupil you would want. And then the actual colour of the eyes is your best friend's favourite colour. But if you haven't got any friends, I hope you do. I'd be very sad if I didn't have a best friend. But if you don't have any friends, just leave them white. Hair colour. Now, if you're a nerd in real life, add ginger hair. If you are um, just a casual kind of person in real life, do your own hair. And if you're anything else in real life, add dyed hair. And now the moment we have all been waiting for, the clothes. So the outfit has to have a tie, so choose whatever tie you'd want. Colour, the tie, your favourite colour, mine is blue. And now basically add whatever clothes you want behind the tie. It could be an American school where you wear whatever you want, that's what I'm doing or um, UK school or any, anywhere else where you have to have a school uniform. I choose American. Now, if you are older than 10, add loads of accessories on the hair. And if you are younger than 10, only add a few or like one or two or something. Now for the finishing touches, just add a nose and a mouth. And I literally just realized mine looks like a Sabrina glow up. I promise I didn't do that on purpose. Um, anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video. I would love to see what you have created. Bye! Elf OC Challenge If you are a girl use long ears, if you're a boy use short ears. If you identify yourself as anything else, you can choose whatever you want. If you have long hair use an ehog of your choosing, if you have short hair, use a face accessory. If you are the youngest child use grey eyes, if you're the middle child add green eyes and if you're the oldest or only child, use brown eyes. If you have black hair use white skin, if you have brown hair use red skin and if you have any color hair, use any colored skin. Now show your finished OC. Mob OC Challenge Let's start, for the skin, pick a mob that you like the least and make its main color the color of the skin. If it has two main colors make both of them the color of the skin. Now, take the color of your favorite mob and that's the color of the hair. Now for the length, if you started playing Minecraft when it came out, your OC will have short hair. If you started playing when it first got popular, your OC will have medium length hair. If you started playing recently, your OC will have long hair. And if you started playing when it was losing popularity, you can choose the length. Now for the eyes. You can pick the eye shape. And the color will be the color of your favorite easter egg in the game. Now the outfit. If your favorite log is oak, the outfit will be casual. If it is birch, the outfit will be fancy. If your favorite is spruce, your OC will wear armor. If it's dark oak, your OC will have a magical appearance. If your favorite is acacia or jungle, they will have a worn down or survivor appearance. Lastly, if it's crimson and or warped planks, you can pick. Now for the abilities. If you prefer to play in survival, your OC will spawn with wolves to protect them. If you prefer creative, they can teleport. If you play in hardcore, they are very strong and can take out almost anything. 
If you don't really play Minecraft, they are excellent runners. And if you aren't sure, they can climb any block. That's it. We're done. Now, give them a name and a story to make them unique.